Oh, I'm Dionic, and welcome back to Let's Play The Walking Dead. Uh, so we are starting episode 5, No Time Left. And I'm sure Clem is going to continue to be a badass at some point. Murdering tons of civilians and such. Like, I don't know. I don't know if that's badass or not. That's kind of villainous. Alright, let's go. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. So there was just a Windows update, so I'm hoping it didn't affect me at all. Also, my hair is still a little Previously wet. on The Walking Dead. What if my parents come home and I'm not there? I've got my walkie-talkie in case they try that way. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. Here, you can have some too. Oh yeah! I actually did forget about that. They always stay in the same place when they go there. The Marsh House? Yes, that's it! Excuse me. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? We gotta go! <laughs> Is that why it's yeah. relevant? Why? Clementine? Clementine! Oh, no. Clementine's gone. Wherever she is, I have to find her. This is something I have to do alone. We'll look for Clementine together. Hell yeah. She's my family now. She's all I got. Hell. In the end, family's all that matters. You're right. I owe her. Somehow, I gotta make it right. <clears throat> you owe all of us. Actually, Ben. Hello, guy with orange text for words. Because they don't. This game is a series of deficit of choices in the story. Vernon! Zombie train! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Yeah, I guess I should have lit that fire. Are you alright? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! No, that zombie has a booty. It's not Vernon, if that's what you're thinking. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. You're fucking dead! I don't know who you are, but I will kill you! Do you understand? I know you will. She knows you will. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Just hold on, Clementine. I'm coming for you. We're coming, baby. We're gonna murder everyone. Don't worry, pal. We'll get her back. I got a small army of five people. Yeah, five people. How's that feeling? It sucks. Ah, uh, doesn't matter. It doesn't what it is. We don't have much time. <clears throat> We're about to have a lot less. We'll all make sure nothing gets in. You're still the smartest fucker out of all of us. But try to find another way out of here. And that's coming from a borderline racist. He's from Florida. I was kind of hoping they dug some secret tunnels or something. Hey, don't worry. We'll find Clementine. Damn right we will. No matter what. To do that, you gotta get us another way out. I'll just talk Good to everyone. There's no axe holding that door closed, huh? Oh, shut up. Ha! Ah! I, I, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm talking to everyone. Dead filling the sewers and God only knows how many up top, so, you know. Don't worry about this door right now. We got it. Okay, well, that's what Kenny has to say. Okay, there's a brain wear. There's another thingy here. 
That's empty. I, I don't know. <laughs> I love his blank expression. Some surgical supplies. I take it with you. I would I would be taking everything. I would be a pack rat in the zombie apocalypse. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, take that. Looks like a car jack. I don't want to imagine this being used on a body. It's to spread the rib cage open, right? Okay, so I have this. I assume I'm gonna have to pry open a door with it. Elevator, right? Yeah, I'm gonna shoot the... Use rib spreader on elevator. It sounds like there's things behind this door. Yeah, that does not I'll sound have good. Doors open in two seconds. <clears throat> Is it... Is it an elevator filled with zombies? This is... This is happening kind of quick. They should have cut off his arm. Jedi styles. Okay, thankfully there's no salt lick in here. Okay. This has to be done. Sorry, pal. God damn it! Do it. Uh, don't kill me! Stop! He's awake! He's still bitten! So? This is about trying to save him. At the very least, buy him some time. Do we have to cut it off, though? You should have cut it off right away! No, it works. We don't know anything. Is there gonna be a lot of blood? There's gonna be a shitload of blood. What if he dies? Then the rest of us go after Clementine and get the hell out of Savannah. Yeah! Let's do it. Maybe it'll work. It's a big risk. Yeah. We're down here without a lot of options. Herschel that! Yes! Okay. This is gonna hurt. Cut it off. Seriously. Yeah. <sighs> Let's do it Herschel Styles. It'll be over before you know it. Just gotta get through. Too bad you guys don't have an axe. It was easier when I thought he was out. Knock him out! Oh, Jesus. Fine. Oh my god! I'll go as fast as I can. She is such a badass. If I don't live through this, I need you to know you. Ah! Ah! Try to stay still! Ah! 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 I know! What did I do? <laughs> this is my horror face! What did I do? Hey, Stumpy! Oh my god! That's what he calls his arm now. Holy hell. We thought maybe we'd lost you. You've been out a while, man. Oh, what the hell did we do? Oh. Uh. Phantom Jesus. limb. This hurt so goddamn bad. I hope it helps. Do you think you'll be able to travel? You lost some blood. Uh, apparently, uh, The Walking Dead has a thing about people losing arms. Good. The elevator's open. So I'm hoping that this actually helps. I don't know if it's too late. I don't want to 
bleed on anyone. Because <clears throat> I know Herschel's leg was really early on. If you guys don't know what I'm talking about, don't worry about it. We're gonna have to go as quiet as possible and see if we can make it to an empty floor or even the roof. You think it's possible for you? Yeah. Keep going. Was that a shooting arm? What the hell? What the hell? Watch out! Yeah. Jeez, <laughs> shut the fuck up, man. Everything okay up there? I think I just peed myself. So yes, then. Ha! Oh my god. If the bars are slippery, Ben, I'm gonna regret letting you live. Actually, you guys should be calling for them. Trying to get them to jump out the door, right? That way there's less of them. The more that fall to their death. Outsmart the 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 dumb zombies. The dumbies. Dumbsies. The glompies. No health. No held. Hospital. Remember when Savannah was empty? Those Crawford bastards did one thing right, I guess. Yeah. There must be thousands of them. Well, we brought them in with did us. They follow us here? It sure seems like it. That's crazy. <clears throat> they can't track. They just roam. Is it? That fucking train wasn't exactly discreet. Well, what do we do now? Clementine's out there somewhere. Gobbled up in all of that. We'll get to her, Lee. N don't we'll do you- we have to. Why did you have to use those words, Let's Lee? Let's get our bearings and see if we can figure out a way to make it across town. Good? Good. Okay, I really hope you can shoot with your other arm. Right? He's not left-handed. I don't think he's left-handed. Into the fire. He has both arms in that achievement icon that popped up, so I'm wondering if I did something bad. But I know that if you lose a limb in The Walking Dead, you usually live, right? What's up over here? Bell Tower. That's what's up. Hmm. Yeah. That could help. Okay. Oh, maybe Molly will come save us. Maybe she'll be like, ding, ding, dinner's over here. That'd be cool. Hey, girl. That's the church across the street from the mansion. River Street should be just beyond that. We need to head back that way. We'll stop off at the mansion, like you said, and make sure we didn't overlook anything. You're such yeah. a badass. I she might have a way to clear us a path. I can make it to that bell tower. I can draw the walkers down to that side of the hospital. I'll meet thousands of them. It'll thin out the streets between here, the mansion, and River Street. Even if it's just for a few minutes. She's definitely become one of my favorite characters because of just that sequence. And I'm wondering, uh... If they're going to kill her now. No held. Okay, well, there's a lot. Okay, so I'm just gonna use the ladder to, uh... Ooh, let's look at the feats prints. Walk away from whatever accident happened. Well, that doesn't really mean much. Well, they... kind of fell off the roof, probably. Some poor bastard took a spill. Yeah, looks like whoever was up here painting that sign went ass over tea kettle. That's the scientific term for it. Okay, let's put this ladder in my back pocket. 
Whoa, you need some help with that? Hey! I got it. Hey! I still have arms and legs. Um, okay, can I move, please? Okay, no, I, I just have to click there. Okay. Damn it. Oh, shit. He's moving pretty good for someone who just lost an arm, though. Yeah. Could buy us some time. Draw as many as we can this way. Get down off the roof on the opposite side and bust our asses getting back to the mansion. You think you should be the one to go? Kenny. Thank like you, but chill. Let me do it. I'll do it. Yeah, Ben will do it. If we have to decide who takes a risk like this, it should be the guy who's got the least to lose. What's the worst that could happen? I get bitten again? So we're agreed then. Okay, well... Uh, I, I feel like I must have missed something. I'm sorry if I did. Why the hell are we letting the one-armed guy do all the high-risk maneuvers? Because the one-armed guy insists. Now shut up about it. That thing looks a little rickety. And he's a badass. You keep that shit to yourself next time. Yep. He can still kick your ass with one arm, Kenny. Don't test him. He's smarted, and he's bad acid. Oh shit. Run! 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 Cartoon! Ah. You know, like in cartoons when they run on air? Ha! Ah. Well, you Holy killed shit, one. Man. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. He could probably make Switch that jump back. And mother hand. No shit! Try to find another way out of there? Well, uh, now you know how the Inquisitor feels. If you don't know what I'm talking about, don't worry about it. It's Din Din time. Okay, like. Molly should seriously come help us because you know we love this Molly. Way. Tons of them. Jesus. Now get back here. You can probably make that jump because it's higher. You just gotta run. I think I have to jump. There's no way back. Yeah. You can make it. It ain't that far. I'll catch you. You got this. You got this, motherfucker. God, I love Lee so much. He's so awesome. All right, let's do this. Let's do it. Let's do it. Got it. Got it. I got it. Yeah. Oh, I'm such a badass! Good goddamn leap, pal. Let's get the hell off this roof. I love Lee so much. They they did a really good job writing uh, the pro tags. He's so badass. He ain't messing around. Holy... Yeah. What the fuck? Come on, just come the fuck on! Well, we're not coming back here after we find Clem. Clementine? She gave him the boat? She... I don't think she would do that. Hey guys? No, Clementine's not with the boat. Vernon and his crew took it. No fucking way! They said they didn't you want it! Kids? Their actions, uh contradict your characterization, but yeah, the invalids. He's right. They're not invalids. They're just people. People who've been dealing with shitty situations even longer than we have. No wonder they got the jump on us. I don't give a fuck if their make-a-wish was a fucking boat ride! When I find them, I'm gonna rip their throats out! I can't believe they did this to us. It's sick. It really is. 
They use your goddamn sympathy for sick folks and then stab us right in the back. They didn't use shit. They did what anybody would have done. They've been living like ghosts forever and they were fed up. That's it. Uh, no, they- It feels bad about leaving Clementine behind, but the boat was an opportunity they couldn't pass up. Vernon probably planned this out the second he laid eyes on that boat. Okay, let's they go murder us. them all. Yeah. No, let's murder them all. That, that's, that's it. Seriously, everyone's dead. I don't know why that isn't the solution. Omid, can you go over the fence and let us into the backyard? We shouldn't be out in the open. Yeah. This is not happening. Everything is so fucked. I mean, Clementine is still out there. So we get Clementine, and then what? We and get the we... fuck out of cities. I'm done with cities. We go into the countryside and make a go of it. That's smart. Yeah, that seems like a good idea to me. Nobody no, it asked is... you. You just did. Don't get fucking <laughs> smart with me, Ben. Chill. Do you remember we had a boat? A boat! Worry about the boat after. You can scour the goddamn coast looking for him. I'll make that bastard wish the cancer had got him. You're welcome to. Wow. Just calm down for a second. Yeah, chill. My hair's slowly drying, so it's getting all poofy. Ben, I would shut your mouth. We can Seriously. Ben, I swear to God. No, seriously. Ben, it, you're on thin ice. Get to the countryside. Dicked around with cities and coastlines and boats too long. Take her out there. Live as safe as you can, okay? Look, I agree with you. I think out in the country is the safest place to be. But you're not dead yet, so put a pin in that, okay? I'm kind of hoping We're that he doesn't die now. Off. I'm just saying we should all chill, not just you. Chill. Lee's bitten and God knows how long he has left. Clementine is who the fuck knows, and we're robbed of the only hope we've had. So? So Lee should have left your ass in Crawford. We got enough problems. Fuck you, Kenny! Ah. Uh, Careful, guys. No, let him. I am so, so, so sorry about Katya and Duck. I am! And I know I fucked up. But stop pushing me around and stop wishing I was dead! No! You know how they died. You've said goodbye. I never got to see my family, my parents, my little sister. Do you get that? That's true. Your family is gone, but at least you had them to lose. I never made it home. They could be alive or dead or walkers or worse, and I don't know. So give me a fucking break. But he has someone to blame for it. Um. You know? Oh shit! Here they come! In the house! Yeah, cause all that yelling, uh... All that yelling was good. They shouldn't be able to get into the backyard, right? Maybe not. We can secure this place. Krista. Uh, weapons. Search the house for weapons. On it. Kenny. Upstairs. Go upstairs. Secure whatever you can and make sure we're alone. Done. Ben. Uh, move furniture. Move anything you can up against the doors and windows. Got it. Omi! What is it? Yeah. Everyone, help Omi now! <laughs> Screw you, doggy door hand! Lee, help! Cut their fucking arms off! Gotta be a knife or something in there. Uh, did I see one? Hurry. Oh shit. Uh, yeah. Check the knife drawer. Yes. Yes. Your goddamn arms off. Yes. <laughs> Looks like you're missing a hand. Lee, just take one of their arms and use this as a prosthetic. That's ever. Oh, screw your fingers. There we go. Now what? Uh, this is a big, sturdy house. It'll hold. Yeah, I think so too. <laughs> <laughs> I changed my mind. Shit! Get upstairs. Go. I changed my mind. Oh my god! How did you get here?
All right, just a sec. Oh, sorry, I gotta, I gotta find. Okay, there. I it started getting a little wobbly. Guys, help me with this. All right. Do it. Do the thing. Do the thing. Don't just stop. Everyone, get to the end of the hallway. What do we do now? This will slow him down. We get to the end of the hallway. Take a fucking stand! Can't let ourselves get trapped. Let's get as many as we can. When we see an opening, we go for it. How many bullets y'all have? Three. Five. Four. Two. You all know where to aim. Get ready. Aim for the balls! That's their weak points. Done. Done. Oh, what the hell? Okay, I hit the one behind. Am I out? Yeah, I'm out. Oh, that sucks. I should have held off. Me too. Fuck. Where do we go? There's no goddamn opening. Up. All right, let's do this. Come on, guys. Uh, yeah, crawl as slow as you can. It doesn't matter, you're out of bullets. You can come back for it later. Twice shy. Achievement unlocked. Um, I'm not good with these. You dropped it down there. Sweet! Thanks, Ben, for still being alive. Okay. Lee's still bitten. Shut up. Okay. Let's get out of here and keep moving. Kid's right. We gotta keep moving. Think there's any chance we get Clem and catch up to those goddamn thieves? I don't know. Maybe. Well, we're not going out through this window. No latches, no roof access, and 30 feet straight down. Anyone have any ideas? I bet this guy would. He's got a resourceful air about him. Knock it off. Dixon <laughs> Kent the Third, Industrial... Mead? Krista! Ha! Just trying to lighten the fucking tone. We need solutions, not stupid jokes. Ah, uh, both are good. I'm sorry. There's gotta be another way. Check the floor for any other access, a vent, anything. Or we wait for the house to clear out and stick to the high ground. <coughs> hey, you're not looking great, and you're warm. It's because I lost an arm. Back off. What did that mean? She's at the hotel, where her parents were staying. He hasn't moved her. Yet. Yeah. Yet. We need to start thinking about more than just Clementine when it comes to our... urgency. What do you mean? How do we get out of here? That's the whole point. We don't know. Okay, now your life depends on it. How do you get out of here? I don't know. I don't get it. I do. Stop it. We can't panic. Do you think that worked? I, I don't know. I hope so. I think we need to have an adult conversation about what happens if Lee takes another spill. Hey, look. We could be looking at a Larry situation here. Who's Larry? It don't matter. I think it'd be best if we just worried about getting to Clem right now. We're not gonna do her any good if you've attacked us. That isn't gonna happen. How do you know that? Because I'm missing an arm. I don't know what happened before Omid and I showed up, but we can cross this bridge when we get to it. Lee, I'm not advocating anything here, but how is this not a thing? We're all so worked up about Clementine that we're forgetting what the fuck happened to you. Oh, I'm really glad I got you looking out for me, for Clem. This is just fucking great. Relax, Lee. This is getting out of hand. You're gonna listen to me! We will get Clementine back, with or without you. Because I haven't given up everything to die because we were stupid. I'm sorry, okay? Fuck, we can't do this! We're gonna have to! Ah! I... You ruined that dude's face. 
Shut up, sweetie. Look. Okay. I don't know why people don't road into hell. Even if it wasn't, you could still dig through the wall. No, this mansion butts up against the one next door. I'll be damned. We're not lifers on Alcatraz. Exactly. I mean, people dig out of prison, you could just dig through wood. Is this really possible? Yeah. We can do this. Literally okay. think outside the box. Shifts. Whatever that means. Krista and I. Lee, you rest. We have to work fast. Sorry. Me too. I get it. Go sit down. I didn't feel like that was that bad, really. I felt like it was Glad fine. You told us when you got bitten. It would have been easy not to. Yeah. Yeah. We probably would have let you go alone if you hadn't told us, which would have been a mistake. If I were you, I would have been scared shitless. I was. The fucking thing, it, it happened so fast. You ever almost hit someone in a crosswalk almost his license was suspended twice just wait thing was on me never saw it like someone in your blind spot it's so weird you keep doing a double take on your arm expecting it to be there i'm hoping whatever's in there bite is how do you think he feels what do you think the odds are of that i don't know i know everyone's wondering even if it just slows down the process i'd be happy you don't mean that. So when we get this guy, what do you think? We figure out who he is, and why he's doing this. We can rescue Clem, but she won't be safe if this guy's not gonna stop. So, did your crew get into any shit before you met up with us? Is it possible to have survived and not gotten into some shit? And, true. You know, whatever happens to you, uh... Seriously, can we not talk like that? The entire time we were at the hospital, I could sense you think you're as good as dead. I was bitten, Krista. You cut it off. What good is it to plan around that work? What good is it for you to give up? I haven't given up. I want you guys to take her. Stop it. I'm serious. She'd be safe and relatively happy with you two. We're not that, doing this right now. That is true. Krista, listen to him. Better than Kenny, anyway. Want, okay? I think, want. in my opinion. We uh, gotta support him. He's only a kid still. It's easy to forget that. He loses shit like that often? No. That was a first. It's good that he did. Kenny couldn't pull that shit on me. He better not do it again. He ruined Kenny's life. Outbursts like that aren't fucking appropriate. You do feel bad for him though, right? No, I do, well, but... Seems like it got through to Kenny. Kenny has a reason. Right. You know? A person to blame. If Ben had a reason and a person to blame... Sure. If you don't count an infected leg. You want me to do it? Nah, and you can hop in after me. Those are bricks now. behind that. It's good we're forced to take a breath. Uh, that, uh, feeling any better? Still feels pretty recently chopped. So, no, Kenny feels about as, uh, good as you'd expect. I mean, do you think it worked? Did it, did it help at all? I feel like a man who got bitten. So, take that for what it's worth. I still can't believe you went and got chomped. Just fucking hell. At least he told us. Took some brass. I don't think I would've. How are you? I'm... Uh, I don't know how to answer that. I'm sorry. You've lost more than anyone. 
It'll be all right, kid. Why are you acting like what's happened ain't happened? Anyway, I appreciate it from both of you. A lot of us have lost families. Maybe take it easy on him from here on out. I'm angry as hell. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe not. You heard it outside. I did. I never really thought about it that way. I mean, that's true too, but like... Maybe you don't murder- Yeah, you probably shouldn't do that. No. No. This guy tell you much about what we've been through? Bits and pieces. Before y'all, we had this woman, Lily, with us. Lord knows where she is now. Anyway, we had to... Make some tough calls with her dad. She came between Lee and I pretty good. And I spent a lot of nights hating this guy's guts. I'm sorry for hurting you in any way, Kay. It's impossible to go through life without causing some sort of pain. But sometimes I can't help but wonder if I could have caused a little less. You and me both, Doc. I don't know what that... I don't know what that's supposed Jeez. to mean. I didn't cause any pain. He's he he did murder a She's with child. I'm through. Okay, no, that wasn't brick, that was carpet. Okay, no I feel better now. Things are looking oh no, it was brick, I guess. Also, holy crap. He's pretty, he's pretty hardcore. Okay, so unfortunately I'm gonna have to end this here. Uh, thanks so much for watching. Leave a like, comment on what you think of the game so far. It's pretty awesome, I didn't want to stop playing it just now, but I really have to because these episodes are getting long. Uh, go check out the other videos I've done, and I will see you soon. No, 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 no,